everybody. Han here. And Betty. And Betty, oh my gosh. She has to get up. I haven't even gotten out of bed yet. It's been raining all night and it's raining. Like, <coughs> oh! God love her. She wants to get out and go potty. Okay, okay, okay. Oh. I'm awake, kind of. And so is Betty now and she's not crawling all over me. Ha <laughs> ha. So it's raining. It's going to rain all day today, so it's going to be indoor projects. I'm looking at the walls. Hmm. I wonder if I look, look at my walls if I can get any ideas on what I need to do today. I've got a great idea. I'm going to make those little solar lamps out of the mason jars. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? I made two of them. The light is actually very bright. So having two of these around is going to be great. I put this thing through the ring. And then I put the lid on and just very gently secured it. And there it is. So to make it more permanent, I will uh, I'll, I'll put some glue on it and whatnot. But it's very pretty. It's very bright. And I can't believe it. They are still, still shining very brightly. Even though that it was just charged yesterday. Well, yesterday and the day before. But these stayed on all night long. And it's going on 9.30 now, I guess. 9.30 in the morning. And they are still shining brightly. What do you think, guys? Do you think I'm, I'm a crafty person now? Yeah, that one bugs me because it's not... The lights aren't distributed evenly enough. So I'm going to have to go and fix that. I know. I'm, I'm so pedantic. Yeah, there you go. It's going off and on. I want it to stay on, though on all the time. I think that's on all the time. But in how in that pretty? I love it. Look at that face. You know what she wants? She's drooling. She's drooling. You want a bone, Betty? You want a bone? See, she's trying to be super, super good right now. She knows that she's good. She's going to get one of these bones. There you are, sweetness. Let's see how long it takes her. She loves them. Gosh, I need to vacuum this floor. Yep, she loves these bones. Look at, she's already demolishing it. Well, I'm not going to make you sit here and watch the whole thing, but she really, really loves these bones. And I tell you what, her breath has improved drastically <laughs> since I've been giving them to her. So thank you, Connie. And Betty thanks you too. I want to give you a better look at that screen door that I got. I hope you guys can see this okay. I don't have any lights on and it's kind of dark in here. But this is the screen door that a subscriber got for me and sent to the local Home Depot for me to go pick up. And it is just gorgeous. It is the right size. I just need to make a slight adjustment on the size. Um, the length is perfect. The width, I need to take just a little bit off of one side, so I need to find somebody with a circular saw who, who can help me do that, but it's going to go into the door just fine, and it is made of vinyl, so it's going to last forever and ever and ever, and I can't wait to get it on the front. It is going to look so, so cute, and it's going to match the white trim on the tiny house, so thank you, anonymous person, for this beautiful, beautiful screen door. Just as I was trying to close out this video, first the FedEx guy came and dropped off that long black one, and then UPS came, and it was one, two, three, four, five packages. So, you know what I gotta do. You guys know what I gotta do. I have spent the last five minutes just trying to get the plastic off the box. So let me get this all unwrapped, and then I'll show you what's in it. Getting into this has been like getting into Fort Knox. Oh. So let's see. Now I know that the, some of my subscribers have told me that they're, they are sending me things. And I don't know what day, what exactly they are. But gosh, I just want to snap my fingers and have this be open. What's in there? <gasps> oh... Oh my gosh, okay, I did not know I was getting this. I did not know I was getting this. Hang on, let me pull it out. Look at this, you guys. Somebody got me the machete. I had just put this on my wish list, and I cannot believe it is already here. Somebody got me the freaking machete. Alrighty, let me see if I can figure out how to get it out of this. It can't be too hard. 
Oh, yes, look at it. All right, let me get this plastic off. Look at this. Serrated on one side and a very, very sharp blade on another side. This is great. It's not going to be too big. It is, it feels good. It feels good in my hand. And it is, it's coated with like um, an oil of some kind that just makes a beautiful sheen on it. I'm going to be able to saw with it. And I'm going to be able to hack down weeds with it. All those ones that the big, that that little weed whacker couldn't get. I am totally, totally going to be able to do this now. I may even be able to chop wood with this. Ho, oh, ho, ho, my goodness. I had absolutely no idea I was getting this. There's, there's no name. There's nothing on the box telling me who sent it. So I don't even know who to thank. Ha! Huh. Let me just double check to make sure. Nope, there is nothing in there that tells me who sent it. But this is absolutely amazing. Ho, ho, ho. Thank you so much, whoever you are. I absolutely love this. I can't wait to get this thing in action. Yes. Ha, ha, ha. All right. Mystery package number two. Let me feel around. What is this? What? Oh, oh my gosh! I didn't know I was getting these either. You see what these are? These these are like little airlocks that you can ferment stuff in mason jars. Here, let me open this up. Oh, this first part is the airlock, and for those of you who don't know, it comes with this little thing inside. And how that works is this goes down over the top of that little tube so that air can escape and not get back in and there's a little fill line somewhere I don't know I usually fill it to about right here and you fill it with a little bit of fluid so that the bubbles can get out and air can't get back in and you just push it down in here it's a little rubberized grommet and then you put the cap on and the cap has little holes in it so I'm going to be able to use this with my wide mouth jars and I've got a whole box of them and when I'm not using it to ferment food I can use that to make wine. So that is awesome. Let me look at these papers and let's see. Love, love, love your way of living. Thanks for all your inspiration and hugs from Everett. Thank you Everett. I absolutely love it. It is perfect. Uh, of course, I had these on my wish list, so I didn't know that I was getting these, though. So, so thank you. I'm going to use the heck out of these things. Let's see what's in this box. My poor little knife needs to be sharpened a little bit. Hopefully, I don't impale myself. There we go. Let's see what this is. Oh, 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 oh. Somebody did tell me they were getting me this. I've been waiting on it. I think this is the tripod. Yes, I think this is the tripod. I think it's the tripod. Hang on, let me open it. That's exactly what it is. It's got a little remote control thingy. Um, I guess this is what you mount the camera on. Here it is. It comes in a really nice, nice carrying case. So... I'm going to read the instructions and put this together and you know what, hopefully this will help my video recording improve drastically. Okay, look! <laughs> no hands! Alright, the person who got me this wants to remain anonymous, so thank you so much. This is going to be... I have to learn how to connect it properly. <laughs> okay, I got this huge phone and it... Uh when it's in the case it doesn't fit inside as well so I took it out of its little case thingy and let's see if I put this up a little bit higher and it fits perfect so I mean it's like a six and a half half inch screen so I get to where am I supposed to look over here yeah I think I'm supposed to look over there I need to learn this stuff seriously so thank you so much for this it is definitely going to make things easier for me so, I have actually three more packages I get to open, and well, let's just do it. All right, I'm going to put my glasses down and get this one. This one! 
Let's see. It shakes. Oh, it is. Huh. Ha, ha, ha. This is so much better with a tripod. And now you guys get to see me fail at you know, like doing building things <laughs> because I have no excuse now not to show it since I have a tripod. All right. Let's see. I did know I was getting these and I just found out, I think it was yesterday or the day before, lemon balm seeds, you guys. Can you see that? Is it backwards? I don't know. I can't find lemon balm anywhere. I can't find the plants in stores. I've not been able to find the seeds. So I know who gave this to me and I'm not sure if I'm allowed to say who, but these are wonderful. Thank you so much. I love it. I love it. I love it. All right. Now, oh, oh, yes, 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 yes. I had this on my wish list too. They also told me I was getting this. Well, actually, they didn't tell me they was they were getting me this. They told me they were getting the seeds and then something else. And this, this is a sweeper and it doesn't need electricity. So um, I'm gonna, let's see if I can just open this now. I'll tell you what, I'm gonna open this and um, then I will put it together and I'll show you what it looks like. Over there. there it is. Let's give this a try and see how it works. Whoops. Yeah, it definitely does work great. Right on. And there's the shark. It's charging right now. You can see I've already used it. I was going to do a demonstration video, but um, actually I was going to do that today. But the battery's dead, so that's going to charge up eventually. And this picks up really, really nicely, and it doesn't require any electricity, which is a total bonus for me because on days like today, see that, is overcast. Um, I'm barely getting any voltage into my solar battery, so um, it's going to take like two days to charge that, um, but it works great. The Shark works great while it's, whoops while it is uh, all charged up and whatnot. Okay, that's enough vacuuming. So I'm gonna be able to use both of those sweepers. I, I like the Shark, but I also like the, the Shark is real good for picking up stuff off of like the drywall. I was sweeping up the, the drywall that was all over the floor and that gets it up pretty good. But I what I like about this Bissell sweeper is even on a cloudy day, if I have no battery, you know, storage, I can still use this little sweeper and it's gonna just keep things clean. So awesome, I've got a note here. Hi Ann, enjoy your gift from Lena M. Uh, the Red Road Warriors, thank you so much for helping with that land information, Lo much love. I can't wait till you guys get down here. It's gonna be exciting. Just shoot me an email and let me know when you're, you know, fixing to come down here. All right, what's next? I've got two more packages. Oh, this is a heavy one. All right, let's see what's in this one. See, this one. Okay. <laughs> this is like... This is like Christmas! All right. <gasps> what? my gosh I know what this is this all right I'm gonna show it to you this is a basket and I think it has nummies in it let me make sure I'm gonna pull it out it's a nice basket all right so recently um, I had like tried out letting a couple people like collaborate on my Amazon wish list so I have a, a friend back in Ohio and um, he put a bunch of food items on my wish list, and this is one of them, so I don't know who it's from. I don't, is there a note in the box? Okay, let's see. I'm going to probably, well, here, let me, let me just turn this around for a second, okay? It has a pretty bow on it, and let's hope this doesn't take me too long. I may have to edit a lot of this stuff out. 
Um, and this is Velcro. Good. How can we use it? Oh, okay. See this, this basket? Look how nice it is. And it's got a lid on it, too. And I don't think there's anything in here. I think that's just to absorb moisture. I think that's the same with this, but I'm going to make sure I'll open it up. Look at all of this delicious stuff. I have snacks. I have snacks. I have been wanting snacks. I'm all out of snacks. Look. I've got really nummy, nummy looking olive oil and sea salt crackers. I have nuts. Looks like almonds. Oh, yum, yum, yum. And cheddar cheese. Shelf stable sh cheddar cheese, which I really like. I've got apples. I've got a couple different kinds of apples. Look at this. Look at this cute little thing. I get to eat it. Um, and an orange. And this must be, this is a mandarin orange I get. Oh, looks like they're, these, I wonder if those are all three mandarin oranges. Um, and these are different kinds of pears. There's one pear, there's two pears, there's three pears, and another apple. Or what the heck is this? Yeah, it is, it's an apple, I guess. I can't wait to eat this. You know what is really funny too? When I see fruit, the first thing I think of is not like taking a bite out of it. It's like, gosh, this would make some great wine. <laughs> So let me see if I can figure out who sent this. Hang on, let me let me find my box and see if I can figure it out. Okay, I got a note here. It says, "Hi Anne, thank you. Uh, thanks for sharing your journey. I'm a 52 single woman living a dream through your experience. Oh, enjoy some fresh fruit. Grateful yours, a charmed viewer. Does he give a name? I don't think it gives a name. It does not give a name. Huh? Oh well, thank you. Grateful." Um, char thank you, Charmed Viewer, whoever you are. This gift basket is very, very special. Will you look at that? The basket alone is just gorgeous. And you know I had been looking for baskets. So this is after I'm done eating all the fruit. It's going underneath the bed. And where did that little lid go? It's got a oh, here it is. Yep. I'm going to put it all back together so you can see it. It's got a little lid on it, so it looks very, very cool. Isn't that awesome? I love it. Thank you so much. Okay. Um, there's one more. It's a big box. Oh, okay. Let's see. It's already partially open. It looks like it got opened en route. So let me just... Oh, this is going to be another long video. I know what this is. All right. I was told I was getting this. Um. <laughs> oh, it's big. Oh, there went my tea. <laughs> That's okay. Didn't spill. Hold on, hold on. This is big. Look, it's a dog bed. It is a dog bed for Betty. And you know what? I'm not sure if I'm allowed to say who sent this. I don't think she'd mind. It's from Connie. She sent me this big old dog bed for my girl. <laughs> Look at her. So I'm going to find a space for this. She's going to love it. I think that she's going to like sleeping on this soft side. Oh, yeah. And the bottom side is a nice color, too. It's like a, a blue with a yellow yellow greenish um kind of like a plaid so thank you so much connie and thank you everett and thank you um a couple other anonymous people for everything you gave me this is amazing um i mean the machete oh my gosh i have no idea who sent me the machete but thank you that is going to make such a huge difference so well i was going to talk about some other things in this video but um, I think we're done. I think, I think I need to go eat some of my fruit. <laughs> and even though it's raining outside, I'm going to take that machete and hack some stuff to bits. 
anyway, that's all I got for you guys today. I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.